Welcome back to Fear. Let's look around for any secrets hiding behind the air vents. Nothing. Still no word on Jankowski. It's like he just vanished. The weird thing is that the bodies of the Delta team he was with are all accounted for. So everybody in his team was accounted for except for him. Hmm. I think that leads up here. I think it's a switchback staircase. Yep. I was hoping he wouldn't turn, so maybe I could come up behind him and hit him in the face. Or kick him in the face, rather. That wouldn't have actually worked, though, even if he did keep going forwards, because the other guy was behind him. But yeah, either these guys have more health or take less damage on the higher difficulty levels. Or perhaps these later game enemies just have more health, because that dude took like three or four of these massive penetrator rounds to the face or the face region, before dying. Which is pretty incredible. Oh, stupid. <laughs> For some reason, sometimes... Sometimes when I go into slow motion, it just, like, the particle effects go crazy and just block the view. Oh, I missed. Whoops. Yeah, you know, on these higher difficulty levels, it's just not really worth it to do any kicking. It's just too slow and requires you to get too close and it's too imprecise. Just way too imprecise. It's really easy to just totally miss by just a, just a little bit. Like right there. It's really fun, but it's not worth it on these higher difficulty levels, I don't think. Explosive. That ain't explosive. Lies. Never mind. I believe you. Oh shit! Oh god! Okay, I'm fine. I 
I kept trying to shoot the grenade out of the air, but I just couldn't quite hit it. More footsteps. You know, I don't really throw many grenades, but I just realized. I could throw a grenade, go into slow motion, and then shoot it out of the air. Shoot my own grenade. It's not a bad idea. Particles. I'm pretty sure that's just some sort of a visual bug. I don't think that's intended. I mean, look at that. this thing a bit. Oh, you're dead. That's the kind of awkward thing about using the penetrators, that you pin people to the wall and sometimes it looks like they're just standing up. Look at that guy right there. Like, he's just chilling. There was another one. I guess not. Unless he retreated. fight of some sort. You don't know who you are. I don't know if this game actually has boss fights now that I think about it. But it's quite classical. It's quite a classical shooter in some ways, so maybe it will. Because boss fights are defi definitely a kind of classic shooter thing. They saw me. Oh no you don't! Fuck you. Fire in your hole. Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> nice tactical roll, dude. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh. The music is so tonally appropriate, too. I think I have to drop down. Fear operative has successfully infiltrated Armacam headquarters building. Safada escort neutralized an ambush. Additional U.S. Special Forces assets have been scrambled. Scrambled? That doesn't sound good. Efforts to establish negotiations with hostile forces have been unsuccessful. Um, additional objective will be to get the company network online so that Fear coordinator can access the system. Okay. The ATC network is offline. I need you to find the server hub and reset it so I can get into the system. It should give us a better idea of what's going on in there. The hell happened here? This place is fancy looking. Well, it's a nice change of pace from the kind of more basic concrete sort of water treatment facility place. Potential. Potentiality. That's a fun word. Maybe if I... By the way, I just want to point out, because I don't think I've pointed this out before, but... What is wrong with my flashlight? Look at this thing. How... how do you even invent a flashlight that stays alight for about... 20 seconds? And then regenerates in about... 10? How is it even regenerating? It can't be solar powered. Is it, like, regenerating off of my own body heat or something? Well, I mean, I guess it would regenerate fast because I'm so damn hot, but... Still, I don't think that kind of technology exists. At least, you can't harness heat that way. That doesn't even make any sense. I, I don't get it. It makes no sense. I don't know why I just tried that again. Let's go this way. I'm getting a slight kind of System Shock 2 vibe. I mean, I'm not in a space station, but... I am fighting basically mind-controlled enemies while creepy stuff happens around me in a fairly high-tech facility. I mean, Alma's no Shodan, but she's pretty creepy.
And let me guess, he barred it up the door, so I can't get it. Of course I can. Ooh. You made the ceiling tiles go floof. Truly, I bow before your power. Stay out of my way. I uh, don't think that'll be a problem, because you seem to have the ability to teleport and walk through walls, so... I don't think we'll have any problems with intersection. Potential. TPS report. <laughs> you know, I feel like I can make like a business proposal to Armacan that would really excite them. Just based on these buzzwords. Just think about it. Mobile. Potential. Potentiality. Synergistic mobile potentiality. <gasps> oh, I'll make millions. I think there's monsters here. I think I just saw a monster go across there. I think it went up into the ceiling. Dual monitor setup, whoa. <laughs> Can I seriously not get into there? Maybe if I beat them out fast enough, I can get in. No, I think there's an invisible wall. You have one new message. First message from an outside number. Peter, it's Carla at Hudson Avionics. Where is everybody? I can't reach anyone over there. I need to talk to Brett about this draft he sent over, but he hasn't returned my call. It's really important he gets back to me as soon as possible. Okay? Thanks. End of messages. This looks like a room in which I'm going to be assaulted from all sides, especially above.
Oh, you can actually attack me. Okay, invisible wall ninjas. Got it. Damn you! What are you doing? Are you trying to attack me or not? I thought he's coming towards me and then walking away and then coming towards me and... I really want to kick him. Come on. Wait a minute, are they doing AoE damage to me? I'm not quite sure what happened, but I think I just took damage. It's kind of hard to tell. Sometimes there's not great feedback on when you're taking damage. So they might have been melee attacking me while I was trying to kick them. I'm not sure. Either way, I think I'm going to stick to the shotgun. It's a lot more dependable than my feet. You have three new messages. First message from... Chuck Haberger. It's Chuck Haberger. I've analyzed the readings and I'm recommended we suspend Perseus till we can figure out what's causing the synchronization. The patterns are identical to what we saw last time. But obviously the consequences would be a hell of a lot worse. Next message from... Chuck Haberger, I got your message. Maybe you've forgotten that when this happened before, Fettel was only a child. And the fallout of that fuck-up was that Origin had to be permanently shut down. This time we're talking about a highly trained military commander with a telepathic link to hundreds of soldiers that don't think for themselves. If you're worried about being behind schedule now, Imagine what'll happen if we end up with a full-scale revolt. Next message from... Marshal Disler. Hi, it's Marshal. Just got off the phone with Chuck Habegger. Really worried about his findings. He said he talked to you about suspending the program temporarily, and I've got to agree. If there's even the slightest chance of another synchronicity event, we've got to take it seriously. I'm gonna head over to the Perseus compound and check things out myself. Why don't you give me a call to my cell? Let's discuss this. End of messages. Hmm, the first guy mentioned something about suspending the Perseus something. Which I know is something important because I believe one of the expansion packs is actually titled like Perseus Mandate or something like that. Hmm. There's even a remote chance of another synchronicity event. What does that mean? The hell's a synchronicity event? Is that like when the moon aligns with the earth in just the wrong way, his telepathic stuff goes crazy and then a little girl pops up and turns people into skeletons?
to be secrets in some of these places. Like a permanent reflex booster in the trash can. Why is there a keyboard on the chair? Things seem to be getting worse outside. things can take a lot of damage. Two full shotgun shots. Wait a minute. Wow, I actually am reading that correctly. I have over 150 rounds for the shotgun. 170 to be exact. That is never gonna run out. I didn't know you could hold that many. I thought you were limited to like 50 or something. there. Don't shoot! My name is Norton Mapes. I I'm an engineer. Shit, it's a civilian. Give him a comm link. Are you okay, sir? I mean, I guess he looks happy. He kind of looks like he was inflated, though. Like, he, he literally looks like he's been inflated. Maybe he's been drinking the dirty water. Hello? Who are you people? The good guys. Are you alright? Oh, sure. I'm having a hell of a time. You said you're an engineer? Can you help me get into the network? What am I, an IS lackey? Tell you what, you disable the local security system, and I'll see what I can do about the server. I can disable it remotely once I'm logged in. No, you can't. It's on a separate network. One second, please. Check for med kits. Potential. Ah, <gasps> secrets. Why do you want us to bring down 
down the security system anyway. Never mind why. You want my help? Oh my Ask god, really? Price. I'll just wait here. Ta ta. Monolith? Run along. Monolith, I like you. Bye bye now. But. This is not known lives forever. You just gonna stand here all day? But, uh, <laughs> your attempts at comedy relief come across like. You know what he's like? He's like, uh, what's that guy's name? Was it Barry from Alan Wake? That fucking obnoxious douchebag. It's like him. He didn't work in Alan Wake. And he doesn't work here. It's basically like, basically the joke is, ha ha, he's fat. That's, that's basically the joke. And he likes to eat. Well, I mean, I guess the joke with Barry, at least I think it was Barry, in Alan Wake, I think the joke was just that he's obnoxious. I don't think they poked fun at him just being overweight. But with that guy back there, that's certainly what they're doing. poos so he eats poos that that is seriously the joke haha ha, he's grossly overweight and drinks tons of soda and eats tons of cheesy poos So the joke is that he's grossly overweight, eats tons of cheesy poofs and soda, and sexually harasses people? Awesome! That, that's a great joke. That is very funny. That is, that is so, so, so funny. I missed. I missed. I missed. Well, that's what I think of that. This is Bravo 12. We're in position. Copy, Bravo 12. Check in. I ain't got no patience for you anymore. Oh shit, I need patience. I'm gonna die! I just realized I ran out of, uh, slow motion juice. Fuck. Alright. Am I going backwards? Uh, no, 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 I'm fine. Hmm, <laughs> Hmm. 
Gotta make sure I don't get flanked. I heard footsteps. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Guns? There's a gun store in there. Oh my god, that's really disturbing. Can you imagine if this game had, like, Soldier of Fortune level gore? That'd be really extra disturbing. These are all for guns that I don't care about. Because I'm full on shotgun ammo, and other than that, there's just an assault rifle and an SMG, neither of which I use. Oh well. That should do it. Mr. Mapes, do you copy? Mr. Mapes! Where is that idiot? Fuck it, we'll just have to do this the hard way. Okay. Find that server and reboot it. Wait, what did I just open? Wasn't it this? Yeah, it was, wasn't it? But isn't that taking me to an area I've already been to? Or is this the opposite side of the- Oh, this is the opposite side of the area. Yeah. I saw the body from the other side. Or did I? Okay, yeah, this is new. Wait for them, shall we? Knock, knock. Who's there, you're supposed to say? Oh, fuck you.
Wait, haven't I, haven't I been in here? I was in an air vent just like this. Oh, wait a minute. I'm getting so confused. Did it open up the place that got closed because of... Well, I don't even know why it got closed. I guess I'm going back? So I, I don't know. Whatever. Just follow the enemies. If you find new enemies, then you're going the right way. to go here? I don't think so. I mean, this is just going in a circle, right? I'm confused. Ah, uh, well. I guess let's go back up. No, there's no point in going up, because it just leads... Yeah, if I come down from up there, that just leads here. Oh, shit. I think this is the server room. And I know I need to press this because there's a blinking thing with arrows pointing to the center that says activate. Some more ammo soon. Right about security being on a separate network. I can monitor the camera feed, but I don't have any direct access to the system. Yeah, most of my enemies are using weapons that I don't use, which means they're not giving me ammo. Got plenty of shotgun though, but uh, I'm running out of my long range weapons. Okay, well, I think I'm going to end this episode here before it becomes too long. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.